I'm telling you the truth that I did see a unicorn. <laughs> Oh good lord, Derek. Okay. So, let me get this straight. You were strolling alone in the forest and you found a large hoof print that might be a unicorn. Right? Yes, that's correct. By the time you stumbled upon to the waterfall up ahead, you actually saw a unicorn standing alone behind it. Am I correct also? Yes. Are you sure you actually saw a unicorn behind the waterfall? Not even a wild horse, a deer, or a wild boar. Please believe me. It's the truth I'm telling you. Why would there be a unicorn in the wild? Do you expect me to believe that? Enough of your bullshit stories. <coughs> Get up, kid. <gasps> Why are you doing this to me? I'm being honest and I didn't do anything wrong. No, you're not. You are a liar, and I should have never trusted you. I'm asking you this one more time. Where is the unicorn? Wait a minute. Did you hear something? It sounded like a horse galloping towards us. What the? Is that the unicorn you just saw earlier? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Is that real? It's coming right through the house. Let's get out of here. It can be dangerous. Now you guys believe me. You go get them, Xena. Okay, we now believe you, Derek. We're so sorry. You sure got rid of them, eh, Xena? Yep, I sure did, with only one quick blow of my budding head. I wanted to thank you for saving me from the hunting bullies. You're welcome, Prince Derek. Now let's move on before they come back. Now on to me. I beg your pardon? Just hop onto my back and ride me. You want me to ride on you? Because I've never ridden on a unicorn before, I might fall. I don't think you're going to fall, Derek, as long as you keep holding on to me tightly. So, are you going to ride on me, or are you going to walk by yourself on foot? Okay, I will ride on to you. Good choice, Derek. Now mount on to me. Alright, let's go. It's getting dark. Where are we going to sleep? In the cave, where no one will find us. Don't be scared, Derek. We'll be sleeping all right. Good night, Princess Zena. Good night, Prince Derek. <laughs> Honey? Dear, are you all right? Where could our little girl be? It is so unlike her to be running away from home all by herself. I don't think she ran away on purpose. I suspect that the horned witch however kidnapped her and took her away from us. <laughs> <laughs>
If it the horned witch could have kidnapped our little, innocent daughter, why didn't any of our guards stop her? It is their responsibility to keep our castle safe. Honey, dear, I know it's very frustrating. We have no idea where she could be. Let us pray for her safe return home and we will never give up on her. Come on, honey, let's go to bed. There's no point of staying up all night, waiting for her to come home. I'm going to wake up the unicorn with my magical hypnosis. You all three wait right here until the unicorn arrives, do I make myself clear? Good. Alright, let's do it before they actually wake up. <laughs> wake up, unicorn. It's time to get up, get up on your feet and shake your legs. That's it. There you go. Now follow my voice, you're almost there. Keep going, just a little closer. Stop. Oh my gosh. Where am I? What am I doing here? What's going on? Well, Princess Xena, we meet again. Xena? Are you still in the cave? Are you outside? Xena, where are you? I'm outside, Prince Derek. Come on out. Xena, was that you? Oh my gosh. You three are back. What are you all doing here? Seize him. Oh no! No! Whoa. What are you guys doing to me? <laughs> Where's Xena? What have you done to her? She is locked up in a very tall tower of my castle. How did you find us? I rescued the three huntsmen with my magical powers. Derek, before they fell to their deaths, your huntsman friends and I decided and agreed to find you and the unicorn princess, Xena. What? We searched all around in this kingdom until we finally saw you two sleeping in the mouth opening of the cave. This is unbelievable. I thought we're buddies forever, but you three huntsmen betrayed me. Let's go, men. Take him to the dungeon of my castle. 